6 o'clock. Uh, it's 10 hours until my physics test. Winter just doesn't work for me, eh? It's still dark. But yet I'm awake. It's exam time at the moment, and the earliest exam I think is at 8 o'clock. Uh, so look how many people are still asleep at 6. Almost everyone. There's one or two people awake. <sighs> you poor souls. Breakfast. Time for a bit of work as well. It's actually really cold here in my room. Uh, I leave the window open permanently just to let the oxygen flow in through here and to keep myself awake with the cold. But I'm actually wearing my gloves this morning. It's the first time in, in forever, really. Uh, got to wear them in a bit more before the hiking trip as well, so I can grip onto rocks and climb mountains with them. I'm so excited for that trip, you know. We've been, I was just saying to my friends yesterday, we've been studying and working since January, you know. Um, it's now June, midway through June. You know, just going and going and going with no breaks, you know, almost no weekends. Um, so I'm really excited to just take a break and go hiking out in nature. So excited. And it's going to be beautiful as well. Can't wait for you to see the footage. I'm also facing another problem at the moment. So it's Monday today, right? And I'm staying here until Thursday morning. And I am running out of food. This is all that's left in my fridge. It's a bit of peanut butter, like a quarter of milk, two eggs, a bit of bread, some rice, mince, and one more mince, and that's dinner. And then a few gem squash and two lonely bananas, some rusks, and a bit of pasta, and like 500 tea bags. Like, it looks like a lot, but I am starving right now, and I had breakfast half an hour ago. It's gonna be a long few days. Good news, however, is that my shoes are getting worn in nicely. Just throwing them around res and uh, jumping around in them. They're getting nice and soft and flexible. They're not so sore around the ankles anymore. Sweating in them a bit. Can't wait to walk in them! How's the physics? Worse. Worse? Yeah. What do you mean it's getting worse? Are you doing a cheat sheet? Yeah. 15 proofs. Your... Ooh. Week from now we'll be done. You're gonna be done tonight. I can nearly smell the freedom. Alright, it's five past three. I've been sitting here the entire day. I'm exhausted. Time to go write physics. I only need 41% to pass. And I'm really stressed out about it. But we'll see. It's on days like today, when I'm super stressed about tests, and exams, and schoolwork, that I remind myself that Jack Ma failed to get into university several times, and Jack Ma got rejected from Harvard ten times, and I don't know the exact quote, I'll put it up here, but if someone like him can go on to start a legendary company like Alibaba, I think he's the richest man in China, and do all the extraordinary things he's done, you know, while not always succeeding massively at university and education, formal education, I think there's hope for us all. Wish me luck for physics. Do we understand we the knowledge? No. Hey, good luck, eh? Thank you. Hope you smash it. 41. 41. How was it? How was it? How was it? I definitely passed. It was so much better than I thought it would be. How was physics? It's bad, bro. It's bad. But you're looking good, bro. You're looking monstrous. I realize. Nah, I realize I didn't have any gym footage today. So. We both trained chess today and it was good. Alright, see you later.
quite what happened that uh, a week or two ago put in a really large piece of bread into my toaster and I had to jiggle it around to get it in there and something broke inside like the metal thing broke so now I have to hold down the uh, the button else it just pops immediately so it's a manual toaster now